I'm your host, Kenna Johnson from The Channel Company. We're going to discover the story behind Vertex Wireless, learn about their role in the mobile device industry, and explore what makes them unique and how they became Samsung's largest device distributor for the B2B channel. To discuss this further is Mike Fleming and Jason Etter from Vertex Wireless. Thank you both for joining me. Let's go to segment one, discovering Vertex Wireless. Can you give us some background on Vertex Wireless? The channel company is a new media network for us, so we're very excited to get more involved in the association and its member companies. A quick little background on us, Vertex is your most trusted value-added technology distribution and supply chain partner serving the mobile industry. We were founded in 2008 by several uh, wireless executives with a vision to improve the device distribution model. Through our extensive wireless experience, we've grown the business to become the nation's most premier end-to-end -end technology distributor. Our strategy brings extreme velocity, prompt responsiveness, and pure mobility to empower our channel partners to compete in a hyper-competitive marketplace. We specialize in the distribution of advanced technology products, supply chain services, and solutions for the wireless industry. Our highly experienced team delivers valuable insight that empowers our channel partners to go to market with flawless execution. You can say we're a new generation distributor, a cut above the rest. We're not like your typical distributors that just move boxes. We're so much more. We really take a true partnership mentality approach with our channel partners. Well said, Mike. Vertex is a different breed of distributor. We are partnership driven, hyper responsive, and take an active stocking position on thousands of products. We strive to go above and beyond our partners' expectations and aspire to become their most essential, valued connection between our OEM and channel partners and their end customers. We take pride in our communication, implementation, and strive to build authentic, honest, and mutually beneficial partnerships. What do you do, and can you give us insight into your role in the industry? Great question, Kenna. We take distribution to the next level by managing a broader role within that supply chain. We solve problems and create robust go-to-market solutions. And we're a prominent player in the wireless industry, primarily specializing in the distribution of logistics of wireless devices and accessories. We really serve a crucial link between the manufacturers, the resellers, and managing that supply chain to ensure timely delivery of products to the end users. We also provide value-added services like customization, kitting, packaging solutions. Our role really just helps streamline the distribution process, ensuring that hardware and turnkey solutions reach end users effectively and efficiently. Yeah, Mike, you covered most of it. And um, in addition to that, we are so much more than just you know standard you know distributor and box mover. We collaborate and consult with our channel partners frequently to create a customized program that both um, our partners, our OEMs, and their downstream customers will embrace. What channels and verticals do you serve? As the VP of um, sales in the enterprise and B2B government, um, that is what our primary focus and responsibility is. Under this channel, we support a growing list of resellers and integrators with focused attention in a multitude of verticals, including but not limited to transportation, education, finance, utilities, healthcare, hospitality, manufacturing, entertainment, government, public safety, right? Just to name a few. Kind of in addition to Jason's remarkable enterprise and government channel, we also serve several other channels, such as wireless carriers, broadband providers, and cable operators. Uh, these channels all consist of like multiple tier one carriers, several hundred MVNOs, and over 100 regional carriers that own and operate their own private spectrum. And then lastly, we also serve several national retailers and e-commerce providers, I guess, as well as merchant wholesale channel. What products and services do you provide? We take a very strategic approach to our product portfolio, Kenna. Unlike other distributors, our expertise and our focus has been on wireless mobile devices. So this includes smartphones, tablets, hotspots, and other ancillary connected devices like smartwatches, wearables, and accessories. We intentionally focus in on these wireless categories as it's been our experience. It's what we've done. It's all we know. And we provide a lot of valuable insight and connections into that wireless industry. We also offer um, advanced 3PL 
services and custom go-to-market solutions. Our team's ability to rapidly connect the dots and enable a robust go-to-market solution for our partners has proven very beneficial and, and creates stickiness uh, with our channel partners and enablement. Um, we offer storage, system integrations, project management, fulfillment, kitting, packaging, asset tag labeling, and an array of managed services. So we're more than just a box mover and a hardware company. Like I said, our capabilities are endless, and a lot of our capabilities are a result of the needs we have identified collaborating with our channel partners. What OEMs do you distribute? Kenna, we have direct supply and distribution agreements and partnerships with almost every Android OEM in North America. So this includes big name brands like Samsung, Google, TCL, Motorola, and Nokia. And there's also several other smaller brands like OnePlus, Orbic, and others. Yeah, five years ago when we were reviewing um, our organization, when we were identifying channels for growth that we were really weren't focused in, um, the B2B channel definitely presented itself as um, a hyper growth opportunity for us. Throughout our learning experience, what we've observed the most is that it's more about what that device does, you know, more than what that device is, you know, how it's, you know, driven, you know, in the consumer channel. And Ken, we'll also be growing our portfolio this year to include different connected devices like routers, gateways. In fact, we're bringing on a senior director of emerging technology that's going to help us build that portfolio out and uh, help us expand our technology portfolio to help our channel partners out. Yeah, and lastly, to add to that, we're continually identifying growing needs and trends in the channel, uh, whether that's through um, our internal teams or uh, through our partners coming over to us and uh, you know collaborating and new trends that are that are emerging. So. We'll continue to pursue and align our portfolio with those offerings to enable our partners to sell more. That brings us to segment two, Samsung and Vertex, achieving dominance in the B2B channel. Why do you consider Samsung the dominant brand of choice for the B2B channel? Samsung has been a great partner for Vertex to work with and often regarded as a dominant brand of choice for the B2B channel due to several factors. One product range, Samsung offers a diverse range of products tailored for business use, including smartphones, tablets, monitors, digital signage, uh, knocks, and other equipment. This broad um, product portfolio allows businesses to find the right solutions that meet their and their end customers' specific needs and requirements. Samsung is also known for producing high quality products with advanced features and reliable performance in the B2B sector where Businesses rely on technology for critical operations. The reputation for quality and reliability is crucial. You know, innovation, you know, is big in the space, you know, and Samsung's, you know, definitely recognized uh, for its innovation in technology and design, continually introducing new features and advancements that appeal to businesses seeking cutting edge solutions. This innovation helps businesses stay competitive and efficient in their operations. Um, with B2B2 customization and integration, Samsung offers a plethora of options and capabilities that cater to the unique requirements of businesses across various industries, whether it's custom software solution, device configurations, um, integration with existing systems. Samsung definitely provides the flexibility to adapt to business needs. Um, you know, a big one too is security. Security is a top priority for businesses, especially now when dealing with sensitive data that's being uh, transmitted by the second. Um, Samsung incorporates robust, robust security features into its devices and solutions, such as Knox's security platform for mobile devices, which enhances uh, protection against cyber threats. In addition to that, you know, Samsung provides dedicated support and services for businesses, including enterprise-level customer service, technical support, um, maintenance programs. This ensures that businesses have access to um, the assistant they need to maximize the value of their products. Samsung has an elite B2B team filled with channel professionals providing unrivaled end-to-end -end support to resellers and end users. Brand reputation. Um, while there's while there's a bunch of options out there, you know, Samsung is one of the most regarded, well-known brands worldwide. You know, strong reputation for you know innovation, quality, reliability, like we touched on. And uh, this brand reputation instills confidence in businesses when choosing Samsung products for their B2B needs. Overall, 
the combination of product excellence, innovation, customization options, security features, dedicated support, and brand reputation. Um, Samsung is a dominant brand of choice for the B2B channel. These factors contribute to Samsung's appeal to businesses across various industries, seeking technology solutions to enhance their operation. We are proud to be Samsung's premier distribution partner in the channel and strive to provide the same level of expertise uh, to our uh, downstream partners. How did Vertex become Samsung's largest and premier distributor for the B2B channel? I guess you could say first and foremost, you know, we have a very strong business partnership. Vertex has established that partnership, you know, mutually over the past 18 years. Our relationship is built on trust, reliability, and effective collaboration while meeting Samsung's distribution needs, and also overcoming shortfalls by other distribution partners. Second, expertise. We've demonstrated that we have the expertise in distribution, logistics, and sales within the wireless industry. So this expertise has really impressed Samsung and obviously positioned Vertex Wireless as a preferred partner for distributing Samsung products in the B2B channel. Third is scale and reach. Vertex has really all the necessary scale and reach to effectively distribute Samsung products across the various regions and market segments. So this capability is attractive to Samsung, especially as they're looking to expand their presence in the B2B channel. Fourth, I would say collaboration. You know, we take a really collaborative approach to identifying challenges that exist for both Samsung and our channel partners, which thus, you know, wins more business in a hyper-competitive market and, you know, tailoring those solutions to overcome them. So in a world of complex transactions, we really simplify that process and we grow the channel alongside Samsung. And then lastly, just as more technology is driving efficiencies in the world we live in, resellers still crave that personalized attention and support. So as much as portals will drive efficiency in businesses, they still want to talk to a human and they expect that human to be responsive to their needs like us. What makes Vertex different than other distributors? Kenna, we are totally the opposite of those other distributors who only care about shipping boxes. We specialize in mobility and emerging technologies. We are remarkably experienced and well-connected in the wireless industry. We take a true partnership position and value our connection with our channel partners. Kind of nobody will out-hustle us for your business. Yeah, and to add what Mike said, one of our biggest distinguishments is that we're human just like you. We value personal relationships with our resellers and foster a win-win for both businesses. Sure, everyone wants you know, lower costs, um, but we provide that VIP distribution experience to our B2B channel partners, which businesses really need in today's hyper-competitive economy. Can I, anybody can move boxes. What we do is we develop, deploy, and deliver turnkey s- supply chain solutions. We take a stocking position as well, which is another differentiator between us and those other distributors. You know, we realize time kills deals. And when B2B customers place an order with our channel partners, they want it yesterday. So we have to have a stocking position available to ship same day, in most cases, same day delivery throughout the U.S., We also, like we talked about, already have a a strategic line card. We don't have thousands of products that are irrelevant to B2B resellers. We have dedicated sales to focusing on that channel, not selling everything to anybody. So in a way, you could say that Vertex Wireless should be synonymous with wireless. When you think mobility, Vertex should be the first thing that comes to mind. I think lastly, another differentiator is that we actually listen to our channel partners. We identify trends in the industry. And we continue to add products and services that are impactful to their business and our partnerships. That brings us to segment three, the evolution of wireless technology. What are some challenges that you foresee in the mobile device industry? The mobile device industry, several challenges that we, you know, continue to monitor and and are ever changing. Market saturation for one, the mobile device market is already saturated in many regions leading to slower growth rates and increased competition among manufacturers. This saturation makes it challenging for companies to differentiate their products and capture market share. Um, We talked about this earlier, especially with Samsung products and Knox, but cybersecurity threats with the increasing connectivity of mobile devices, um, cybersecurity threats are a growing concern. Manufacturers must prioritize security throughout the design and development process to protect users' data and privacy from cyber attacks and breaches. Additionally, we're seeing innovation challenges from OEMs. 
sustaining that pace of technological innovation is a significant challenge. So let's be honest. As consumer expectations continue to rise, manufacturers are going to constantly have to develop new features and capabilities to stay competitive. And this is going to require a significant investment in their R&D, as well as overcoming those technical hurdles. We're also seeing a huge environmental impact. The mold device industry has a significant carbon footprint, all the way from the extraction of raw materials from the earth to manufacturing, transportation of those materials, and end life cycle, the disposal component of it as well. As environmental awareness concerns grow, manufacturers are going to have and feel the pressure to reduce their carbon emissions, minimize their waste, and adopt more sustainable practices throughout their product life cycle. And I would say another one, and just lastly, along with the environmental impacts, we're going to see some supply chain disruptions this year. It's inevitable. Mobile industry relies heavily on global supply chains, which are vulnerable to disruptions like natural disasters, geopolitical tensions, and God forbid, another pandemic. But disruptions in that supply chain can lead to delays in product launches, shortages of critical components, and unfortunately, increased cost. What new products and solutions are you launching this year? We have a very exciting portfolio development in our pipeline for the rest of 2024. We're going to be expanding our wireless portfolio to include some new mobile OEMs that, uh, like Jason pointed out earlier, are very focused in on security and custom built devices. We'll also be expanding our portfolio to include enterprise networking devices like cellular routers, gateways, switches, telematics. So make sure you follow us on LinkedIn and all of our newswires for some of these future portfolio announcements coming up soon. Why should channel resellers want to partner with Vertex? You know, the question is, why wouldn't they? <laughs> no, in all serious now, we have a firm belief in reliability, truth, ability, and strength. Uh, we are easily accessible to our partners, hyper-responsive when you need us. We've always got your back. You know, at our core, we are collaborators and strive to connect the dots to create a mutually beneficial partnership. And I say we care, it's like at times we care too much. You know, we're ultra competitive um, and know that you know, everyone has choices and just know that no one will work harder for you, um, for your business than Vertex. I always say every day in the office, you know, we don't have customers, we have partners. And we went together as a team um, with our OEMs and our channel partners to enable um, and support that end customer. So. You want the best in the business, you know, Vertex is leading the charge. Ken, we all know technology moves at breakneck speeds and Vertex will always be flexible and agile like with like that technology. And our partners expect us to enable new technologies and develop new strategies. They're going to revolutionize their sales and enable them to, you know, overcome competitive advantages. Speaking of technology, what new technology trends do you see happening in the B2B channel? This is one of my favorite subjects. We all like to look at our crystal ball and see what's ahead, right? So there's several trends that we see shaping the landscape here this year of the B2B channel. The most notable of these trends, first off, includes AI and machine learning. You're going to see the B2B channels increasingly leverage AI and ML to enhance decision-making processes, automate routine tasks, and personalize customer interactions. You'll see predictive analytics, chatbots, and recommendation engines are examples of these AI apps that we're going to be seeing in the B2B space. I think second, you'll see more 5G adoption. The rollout of 5G networks is accelerating across the globe, offering faster speeds, lower latency, greater capacity than previous generations. B2B businesses are going to be leveraging that 5G to enable innovative applications such as IoT, AR, VR, remote monitoring, autonomous vehicles. Kind of along with those 5G networks, you're going to see a surge in public 5G networks. Like we saw in public 5G networks, there's going to be a surge in deploying private 5G networks for specific B2B use cases. So those private 5G networks are going to offer greater control, security, reliability, making them ideal for applications requiring those low latency, high reliability connectivity points. I think lastly, you'll see a lot of wireless IoT connectivity. The expansion of those IoT devices in B2B environments is driving demand for wireless connectivity solutions, all tailored to those IoT apps. Technologies such as narrowband IoT and low power wide area networks all enable efficient low power wireless connectivity 
for a broad range of IoT devices, sensors, and machines. There's a lot, Mike. But yeah, in addition to that, you know, some other exciting trends we see happening is the augmentation of IoT devices. Mobile devices play a crucial role in IoT ecosystems, serving as gateways for collecting and transmitting data from connected devices and sensors. Um, B2B organizations are integrating mobile devices with IoT platforms to enable real-time monitoring, predictive um, maintenance, um, and automation in ind industries such as manufacturing, logistics, healthcare, and even smart cities. So several other trends that we we're seeing uh, is the rise of rugged devices. B2B industries such as manufacturing, logistics, and field services require durable and reliable mobile devices that can withstand harsh environments. Rugged smartphones and tablets with features like water resistance, um, drop protection, extended battery life are increasingly popular in these sectors. And some of the best-selling devices of rugged devices, Samsung's got a great portfolio of um, rugged devices with their uh, Tab Active series tablets and XCover Pro um, you know, unlock smartphones. Integration with IoT and wearables. Mobile devices are increasingly being integrated with IoT sensors and wearables to enable new use cases and improve operational efficiencies in B2B environments. An example of that, you know, you could take smartphones and tablets can serve as control interfaces for IoT devices, while wearables like smartwatches can provide real-time notifications and alerts to field workers. Sustainability and environmental considerations. I know we touched on this earlier, but B organizations are increasingly aware of the environmental impact of their mobile device deployments, and manufacturers are incorporating eco-friendly materials, reducing packaging wastes, implementing uh, recycling programs to minimize the environmental footprint on their products to meet the sustainability goals uh, of uh, B2B uh, customers. Great overview into Vertex and Samsung. Where can we learn more information? Ken, it's been an absolute pleasure speaking with you today, and I uh, appreciate you having us on and having the opportunity to uh, convey Vertex Wireless to your audience. Um, in addition to our website, vertexwireless.com, B2B resellers can learn more by contacting us directly via email or phone. Um, feel free to leave you know, our information on the screen, and uh, you know, uh, looking forward to growing our, our channel partners and supporting uh, you know, the groups that you're associated with. Yeah, thank you, Ken. It's been great talking with you. We look forward to working with you and the channel company's membership. Thank you both Jason and Mike for your time today. And thank you at home for watching. For the channel company, I'm Kenna Johnson.